Welcome to the Daily Insight for Friday, January 26. We have two cards for love, two cards for career and finance, and of course we'll follow up with our Romance Angel cards. The first card we have for love is the Judgment card, followed by the Magician. The Judgment card is indicating this is a call from the other side. The universe is giving a second chance, another opportunity, and this is a final opportunity, to look at something that took place in the past to see if it can be resurrected, to see if it can be uh, reconciled. Now, the magician is about having all the tools and resources within yourself to create, to recreate, to proceed forward. Now, what I'm hearing, the message that's associated with this, in a family unit, some of you are receiving message. You might feel this inner pull, okay, this like tug to contact somebody in your family. I'm seeing that there was a huge um, um, blowout in your family unit and the divine wants you to take another look at this situation. What they want you to do is open up emotionally, open up your, um, and look at it from a completely different angle. Look at it from having everything you need to reevaluate that situation and see how you would handle it today versus back then when it originally took place because there can be amends made. Now, this is a family unit. could be friends, too, but it's non-romantic. So you have an opportunity to rectify and resurrect what took place and pull that family unit back together again. This, this is mom, dad, cousins, uncles, aunts, that kind of a family unit. Now, for another group of you... This can indicate somebody from your past returning, right? It's a final call to take action, um, to resurrect something, to bring it back from the dead. So an ending had taken place with this person of the past. And they are coming back to you, which doesn't surprise me. I have a lot of um, people from the past returning. So right now, I'm sure it's because of the astrological situation, all the planets and the alignment that's going on. This person from the past has already reevaluated the situation and they are gonna come back to you and they're gonna share with you their version of what took place between the two of you. There's something that they're going to share with you that you were not aware of. Maybe they didn't disclose it. Maybe you were in such a, a state of mind that you did not hear them. But they're returning to give you their point of view. And you're being called to take action. This is coming from the above. These are two major arcana. So this is going to happen. And it is divinely guided. But they want, they, the other side, want you to take another look at this um, person to see if you can create something brand new with them. Something that is, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Okay, yep. Something that is more in alignment with who you are and who they are where you can come together. Now, some of you will be able to work this out because you have everything you need, and so do they, to really come together in this situation. The point is, even if you decide not to proceed forward with this person, this conversation that's gonna take place is gonna be really good for you because it's going to open up a, a side of you that you didn't know existed. And that'll make sense once the conversation takes place. I know it may be a little confusing, but when they come back, and they will, you'll understand this message. And this will be over the next three to four days, okay? <clears throat> the card that came out is wedding. This situation involves marriage. 
For some of you, this is a person that you're married to and you're separated right now. And they're going to come back and they're going to give you how they perceive it. You know, we can speak to people and that doesn't mean the words we say are going to be... Um, we always have to look at the way it'll be interpreted by the other person. So we can put out the truth, we can say what we want, but it depends on the other person how they receive that. So they're going to share with you their perspective of what took place. And for some of you, it will wind up in a marriage or reconciling where the two of you can come back. You're separated, you're going to... Um, come back together again, which is lovely. And for others, this is somebody from your past where they're gonna come forward and they will share with you and you will share with them exactly what you want and you both are gonna be on the same page, finally be on the same page. But that communication is very important. And for career and finance, and I will relate it to love, we do have the Eight of Wands, which is all about communication communication coming in and we have the two of cups oh this is so lovely okay so in relating this to love you do definitely have somebody coming back from the past now for those of you that are thinking somebody from your past that hurt you deeply you never forgave them there's no way this is not your reading so you don't need to leave those nasty messages about how you would never take them back this is for the people where the two of you may have been um, at odds, but the love is still there. And I'm talking the deep love. And you have an opportunity to resurrect this situation where the divorce may not happen now, where you come back together because you will be able through this communication to see the other person's point of view and they also will understand your point of view. Again, when we speak to others, we always need to look at how they're going to perceive our words. How are they going to take it? When it comes to, this is really lovely, you guys, um, and we'd all like to hear, for those of you that this takes place, again, it's over the next three to four days this will happen. Um, when it comes to career and finance, there is an opportunity, there's a group of you where you are going to be offered to join forces with another person, a co-op, um, creating a partnership to start a brand new venture. This could be in finance co-oping your money to invest in a financial opportunity. What I'm really hearing for you is this is a new business and this other person is going to contact you. They may have met you through your current work, <clears throat> but they are at a distance. So they live in a different state, different country, and they want to join forces and start this new opportunity. And I'm being guided to tell you that it will be very uh, enlightening for you. It'll be very emotionally satisfying for you. But the thing is, you need to take action on it. If you sit on this opportunity, it will pass you by. But you have everything needed, all the skill set, all the education. You have everything you need to bring into this union, this partnership to succeed and this will be the last opportunity so make sure you don't take too long to answer them so i do hope this helps you and you all have a wonderful day much love